easel of existence, betrothed, kneeling in church, standing under the hoppa, the words remain the same. Do you, loneliness, take this bright anger for your wife to infuse your frustration, to abuse in thought your violators, seen and unseen, beyond death do us part? The progeny of such a marriage, fear, devours every morsel of hope, leaving its famished parents loneliness and anger in a mind frozen concrete coffin yet the fingers that grip the pen know no indelible ink is inevitable unchained in the mind of hush silent moments restless defensiveness at rest unfist the fingers angrily holding the wrongs reeled and imagined you have suffered open the hand that clasps loneliness in the frantic grip of life and death reach out with arms ajar welcome hope know you possess pockets of courage in every pore of your being the strength to lift the weight of paralyzing patterns to embark on a life path hidden by the past. The longevity of heartbeat is faintly heard. The quality of its wholeness echoes and reverberates. Ingredients. Nature, gene bequeathed, it is as it was, it is as it is, it is as it will always be. Nurture, parental bestowers, from time to time you stumble blindly, deaf to the plaintive pleas, see me, see me. Your silence sap a part of me. I am not blameless, it is time to shed the cloak of you. I am not blind, yet rarely see the morning dew. I am not deaf, yet rarely, rarely hear the tweet of the well-fed chick. I am not mute, yet rarely speak vowels. There may be no escape from before. The man who chances to discard his chains must know the weight of the chains will be part of the journey. Uh, and the last part, I'm sorry, is called Dueling Definitions. Loneliness, the sentry of moments of unheard voices from within, from without. Not even the melody of pain. Loneliness. The music of knowing your village of loneliness is not found outside the self. It is governed by you. Your rigid laws await amending. Anger. The need-driven decision to diminish I, you, we, in the time it takes to spew out the words. Anger. The knowledge the mercurial mask of self-disdain is removable. What lies beneath is repairable. Fear, the shattering comfort of certainty that behind every unopenable, every openable door lay the deep pit of any swirling failure. Fear, a clarion call to those who choose to listen wade, float, then swim to the distant shore 